Talking about these storms developing early today to the south and west of Siouxland, Burlington Northern Santa Fe Railroad now confirming that a train was hit earlier today in that Waverly and Lincoln area, causing several cars to uh, derail there. No injuries that they've reported. Joining me now is Roger Riley from our sister station WHO-TV in Des Moines. He's been monitoring the uh, areas in western Iowa today for us. He is in uh, Harrison County, Missouri Valley, I believe, Rogers, where you're at. And I know that you've seen uh, some of these uh, pictures uh, seen for yourself of these uh, very ominous looking clouds and uh, dangerous situations. Yeah, right, Tim. I uh, saw the uh, actual tornado warning coming out of Omaha crossing over into Harrison County. Uh, and right now I'm north of Modale on I-29 Heading northbound, extremely heavy rain uh, here in this area. And I did chat with uh, the new uh, emergency manager for Harrison County, Bonnie Castillo. She said me and told me initially uh, there was a tornado that went over the town of Pista near Modale, and so far just minor damage, just a few tree branches, nothing too major, and the first foray. But she said she had to go check some more, so we'll see what the later storms do. But right now it's still coming out of Nebraska, moving into Western Iowa with really a lot of lightning and heavy rain is what I'm seeing, Tim. How, how about heavy a wind there as well? I mean, we know that's a poorest part of tornadoes, but uh, are there any uh, gusty straight line winds or anything like that? Uh, yeah, a few, a few winds uh, with these uh, rain showers. Once the tornado itself went through, there was these rain showers. And they have a few, a little bit of gusty wind, but not, it wasn't too bad. This main thing is the rain and lots of lightning. Okay, Roger, we'll let you go, and uh, we'll check back with you as the conditions permit. We appreciate your reporting there from hey, near no problem, Modale uh, this evening. As uh, Victor mentioned,